Africa Science Week is a week-long celebration of science and scientists. This is an initiative of uh, the next Einstein Forum, Africa's largest forum for African scientists that's connecting science to society. And in Uganda this year, we're taking stock what a science is doing, what have they done, where are they going, and what great things are there to celebrate about science. So right now we're what we are in what we call the digital revolution, sweeping over everybody. It's a revolution that doesn't care if you're male or female, and it has come to disrupt things that are very close to us, you know, like jobs, how we interact with our families, how we communicate, how we study. We believe in science, we believe in educating scientists, we believe in playing a part in forming the future leaders in technology across the world. I can become a scientist and most people think that as girls we don't have that brain that makes us to become scientists. Me, I love science because science is more practical. In the past we've not had secondary school students walking into Andela in their uniforms and asking questions on how to join Andela or how to be better at technology. These are people who are just starting out in physics, economics, maths. They, are, they want to know what does software really mean? Do they have to be excellent at sciences or not? We had a conversation about mentoring and as, as a tool for bridging the gender divide in STEM. We're just trying to get them to be able to exist in the era that we're in now. It's been the utmost privilege for us to have um, the, the next Einstein Forum partner with us on this Africa Science Week program. We've um, hosted the children that we work with at Mark India Community School and we've screened a movie called Big Hero 6. It's age appropriate for the children and we wanted something they could relate with uh, in, in relation to science. So our hope was that it was fun, it was a learning experience but that also there's so much that can come out of science um, and that the children should, be, should know that there's something beyond what they know now and that they should be excited to grow and learn even more. Craftsicle Foundation, uh, we are looking at bringing technology and uh, ICT skills to the children who do not have access and opportunity. And for us working with uh, the Africa Science Week, we are basically looking at how do we partner, how do we identify more children who do not have these opportunities. And already we have been able to identify some kids in different locals because as you know we, have already, we are already in places like Kazo, Kalere, Boise, Katwe, uh, Chisenyi. We are trying to create the next software engineers, we are trying to create the next uh, graphic engineers, we are trying to create basically hard, hard, hardware engineers and in, in relation to STEM. And we have seen this happening. Somebody was talking about developing a scan, I think you recognize him. Right now we focus on community development and therefore we produce, provide the unique opportunity for young people to engage the community and translate their knowledge into real useful things. Tonight I've been awarded the next Einstein Forum Award under the category of STEM. Uh, I've had a contribution in science regarding technology. We've developed a low-cost mobile ultrasound device that can work on mobile phones, a tablet or a laptop so that mothers in low resource settings can be scanned. Science is not simply about knowledge but about applying it in a way that benefits society. Then we can talk about science coming back to us. Being from a low resource country, I believe there are so many problems and there is a wide scope of gap that the youth can innovate within. So science has a very, very key part to play in our lives in Uganda and Africa at large. I, I can only say I think the future is bright. I'm so glad we did this. Uh, finding out lots of people that are going out of their way to, to make science education fun for, for people, lots more initiatives than I knew about. So I feel that, that our goal of taking stock of what's happening in, in STEM in Uganda um, is, I mean, I mean, it's only been the first event of the Science Week, but I feel like we are getting there and just the information that I've gotten today is already a wealth of what we could do with next year. Mm -hmm.